Do your socks stink too? You can fix that by buying socks with a silver nanoparticle coating. What are silver nanoparticles and how do they work, you ask? Silver nanoparticles are natural inorganic metal particles on the order of 1 to 100 nanometers, and they have the capability of killing microbes. It usually appears in the form of powder or colloidal solution. Silver nanoparticles adversely affect cellular metabolism and they inhibit cell growth. They accomplish this by binding to protein molecules which inhibits the cellular metabolism of enzymes. Therefore, the microbe cannot function and it dies. Since silver nanoparticles affect proteins, they also inhibit the replication of DNA, which leads to cell death. This picture demonstrates how silver nanoparticles cause damage to bacterial membranes when they come in contact. The nanoparticles cause structural alteration to the membrane, which leads to increased permeability of the membrane and eventually cell death. But how do they end up in your socks? There are different techniques to add silver nanoparticles to fabric. You can blend the nanoparticles into the polymer matrix before spinning the fabric, or you can dip the fibers into a solution containing nanoparticles as shown here. Why would you want silver nanoparticles in your socks? Fabrics are a great medium for microbial growth when the correct nutrients, moisture, oxygen, and temperature are present. Fabrics have a large surface area with the capability to retain moisture, like sweat. Imagine your socks right now. The fabric is warm and moist thanks to your sweaty, stinky feet. And there is plenty of dead skin and dirt for the microbes to feed on. So your socks are bacteria heaven. The antimicrobial coating of silver nanoparticles allows for not only the control of microbial growth, but also prevents the odor and stains from sweat or dirt, slows the deterioration of the fabric caused by mildew, and decreases the chance of infection. So, silver nanoparticles make your socks more safe, smell better, cleaner, and last longer. Pretty great, right? Silver nanotechnology is a relatively new technology, so scientists disagree about their potential risk to human, animal, and ecosystem health. Some say that silver nanoparticle antibacterial coatings are non-irritating, non-allergenic, and non-toxic to skin because they are not effective on mammalian cells. While others argue that silver nanoparticles have the same effect on human and animal cells that they have on microbial cells. Therefore, silver nanoparticles may have a level of toxicity for humans and animals. This figure shows the specific organs that nanoparticles accumulate in and how the particles enter the human body. As you can see, nanoparticles can enter the human body through skin absorption, inhalation, and ingestion. The particles may then accumulate in vital organs including the brain, lungs, kidneys, heart, liver, and spleen. Silver nanoparticles in textiles may have an increased threat to health through their contact with human skin. The skin is great at absorbing materials due to the rich supply of blood and nerve endings. Studies have shown that skin that moves can be more permeable to nanoparticles. Therefore, silver nanoparticles on socks may pose a greater threat to human health. In addition, some say that the antimicrobial coating is durable to washing, drying, and hot pressing while other studies have shown that washing can leach out the silver nanoparticles, decreasing the antimicrobial function of the socks and increasing the amount of silver nanoparticles in wastewater. Silver nanoparticles are problematic for wastewater treatment for multiple reasons. Nanoparticles are very difficult to remove from wastewater due to their small size and therefore small diameter. These particles take much longer to settle out in a sedimentation basin due to the small diameter. In this animation, the particles on the right represent nanoparticles present in a wastewater sedimentation basin. In addition, silver nanoparticles may be able to kill the microorganisms that are used to treat sewage in wastewater treatment plants. This would decrease the efficiency of the wastewater treatment and cause problems with drinking water safety. Also, if silver nanoparticles are not removed by wastewater treatment, they may enter the surface water and potentially damage biological ecosystems. As you have seen, silver nanoparticles are very beneficial to socks and other textiles because they inhibit the growth of microorganisms. However, more research needs to be done in order to fully understand and regulate their health effects and effects on wastewater treatment plants.